Well, as bad as things are going, <clears throat> I would rather just uh, uh, think about the positives that came out of tonight. Naris had some real good splits, the, some of the best ones I've seen. Lighter pitched extremely well. I, I like the way he pitched tonight. Good to see Knapp hit the home run. Altair continues. He got two more hits tonight, which was positive. Herrera got a couple of hits, so all that uh, considered, uh, we've only scored four runs in three games, and uh, we had opportunities. We had second and third with one out. We had bases loaded twice, only got the one run in via the uh, the walk by Whitey. But um, uh, Eflin, one of his, his poor outings, uh, couldn't locate. The ball was up in the zone. Uh, his, his secondary stuff was uh, what it didn't bite. And he just, uh, he's struggling to keep the ball down. Very, very small. It seems like when he has a bad game, it's a really bad game. <clears throat> well, you know, when he struck out Blackman that first inning, that uh, two-seamer that he threw to strike him out had looked like it had great movement. And I thought, well, we're, gonna, we're in for a good uh, outing from him. But thereafter, he just couldn't get the ball down. He hung a, he hung a breaking ball to him for the home run and uh, got another fastball up for a home run and another one. Uh, he just... Uh, you got to pitch down in the zone. If you don't, you're going to get hurt. You had said before the game that you wanted to get a look at Nap. Do you, do you think that there might be a chance he'll get a few games in a row just to <clears throat> see if he can get some rhythm? I'm going to give him a little more playing time to, to get a look at him. You know, like I told McClure today, I said it's it's hard to, to uh, really be, crit be to critique his game calling ability today because when a pitcher isn't locating anything, it's hard to. You know, when you're a catcher back there, it's tough to know what to do. You know, you don't know what he's commanding, and it's tough to make the right call. But, uh, um, you know, I like him. I just, I'm, I'm going to get a chance to see him a little bit more. You mentioned Herrera is a positive. Uh, after his last <coughs> two weeks, you, you tonight is a step forward for him with two hits, hit the ball hard a couple times. Yeah, I, you know, I, I, I'm, a, I'm a believer that he's going to get back up to where he's supposed to be. And, uh, as I said, he's a very unique individual to where it, it's tough to figure out what his thinking is at the plate, but uh, he has a knack to put the barrel on the ball. He puts the barrel on the ball on a few, few too many pitches out of the strike zone, but um, uh, we've seen it before where he scuffled, scuffled and, but he's come around, so uh, I think he's going to be okay. It was good to see him get two hits. Was his at-bat with the bases loaded frustrating? It's like he had one of the ropes there. <clears throat> You know, when we, don't, when we don't score runs, it's always frustrating. You know, those type of at bats. Uh, um, what what can you say? The, you know, when you don't score runs, uh, it's frustrating to watch uh, the, the at bats. You faced two rookie starters. I mean, do you go into <clears throat> a series like this saying, "Hey, we got two rookies. We need to do some damage here." It's the yeah, that's the way I look at it. And, and unfortunately, we haven't been able to do that. We're, we're just in a, in a big rut right now, and that's why I choose to look at the positives because that's the only way I choose to look at it. Um, I know we're better than this. I think the team knows they're better than this, and uh, I can't fault their hustle. You know, they're, someone might say there's no energy. Well, we, when you don't get any hits, there's no energy. But, we, you know, we, we got some hits. Knapp hit the home run, like I said. Um, there were some positives that came out of it.